Telfer, you guys should sponsor me. Like showing you guys my Telfer collection. So the shopping bags, the Uggs um, collaboration, the East Park, the Duffel, the wallet, and then the Melissa collection. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Worry Babe here. Welcome back if you're returning and if you're new here, hello, what's up? I hope you subscribe if you like the content that you see. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my Telfer collection. I have a nice little number of items from Telfer, so now that I've had them for a while, I'm gonna be you know going through these items and seeing if they're actually worth the price that I got them for. So if you're interested in you know the Telfer collection or you just want to like add something new to your Telfer collection, continue watching. Alright, so I have a couple of different items from them. Um, I have I think five different categories here. I have their regular shopping bags, which I think is the most popular amongst people. I also have one of their Uggs collection, I have their East Park collaboration. Um, I also have uh, their duffel. I don't know if their duffel was a collaboration or if it was just Telfa. I think it might have just been Telfa. Um, I also have the Melissa uh, collaboration. And then finally, I have the wallet. I don't know if that one is in its own category or whatever, but okay, I think I did actually count six. So I'll be going through these and I'll be letting you guys know how much I paid for them and if I feel like it was worth it. Okay? All right. So first on our list are the shopping bags. I actually have four of these. They're so cute. Like these were my very first purchase. I think my very first shopping bag that I bought was probably this brown one. Like this is what kickstarted everything. Uh, the shopping bags are so cute. I have four of them, brown, orange, yellow, and pink. Um, all the same, you know, format, all the same, structure, all the same, like, you know, technicalities and all of that. You have the little logo in the front. You have the short straps here. And then of course you also have the longer straps right you also have the longer straps and then inside is just you know an open space let me put these down and then inside is just an open space with a clasp that you can use here and then the Telfer logo is on the inside this is how all the shopping bags look right doesn't matter the color it's still the same still the same structure still the same format still the same you know design very cute I think one thing that made me really like the shopping bags is different colors like I can wake up tomorrow and just say I want to try this color. I want to get this color and it's like a whole new purchase or a whole new bag. I don't know. I really like their vibrant colors. So these shopping bags actually go for $150 before tax. Yes, these are $150 before tax. Do I think that these are worth the price? I'm not going to lie. Like I said, my very first one was a brown one and I feel like I probably got this sometime 2020 or 2021. So it's been, I've had it for at least three to four years. And this is a brown one that I wear like, it's, it's brown, so I wear it with almost any outfit I can get because you know it goes, it's, it's nude, it can go with anything, right? It's neutral. But like, you guys can see there is no peeling, there is no scratching, like obviously I take care of my property and my items, but like, there is no, oh, the rope is, I mean the, the, the strap is tearing somewhere or fabric is coming loose or something is making the purse not look as it looked when I bought it, you know? And then let's go on the inside, right? I still have this tag in here since from when I bought it. This other tag is still in here. The material has not ripped for whatsoever reason. Like I'm not seeing holes in the bag. I'm not seeing like scratches. I'm not, you know, the clasp is not broken. It's not like, is it worth the 150? Absolutely. Because three years, three years later, it's still going strong. Three years later, I probably will wear this out tonight and I'll be fine with it knowing that it's giving me the exact same quality as it gave me when I first bought it. I promise some of these are much newer than the others, but if I asked you to let me know which one is newer than the other, you probably wouldn't know. Take a guess. Just guess, guess, guess the order of my purchase of these bags. Uh, maybe I'll give you a little sum sum. What, which one do you think is the newest that I have? And can you actually tell compared to the brown one that, oh, she bought this one recently and she bought this one four years ago? Like, you know what I'm trying to say? Worth $150, I absolutely think so. Not only are they stylish, but they're actually durable and, you know, good quality. All right, so moving on from those bags, we're gonna go into the UGG collaboration. 
Yes, these are so cute. Oh, I'm going to be showing 10 products today. I don't think I said that. And out of the 10, two were gifts, right? So this brown Uggs was one of the ones I got um, as a gift that I was gifted. So everything else I bought myself. Um, so these are the two Ugg collaboration I had. This was the very first one that like dropped 2021. I think this was like their first Ugg collab, Uggs, Uggs? I don't even know how to say it. Whether it's Uggs or Uggs. Ugg collaboration and I was like, I want this purse. Like, I dead ass wanted this bag. Like, I was, at this point, maybe I had like two telephones to my name and I was like, I need to get this one because it's so cute. These were so cute, or these are so cute for like winter time. I don't know what about it just gives or screams winter. Maybe it's like the fur and how thick it is. These were perfect for winter. So these actually cost 192 um, for the smallest size. I think it's a little higher than that one just because of the extra like leather or like the extra material, extra fur on it. That's why it's a little bit more expensive than these ones, but rightfully so because this is a whole different purse. You cannot expect the same exact price for a whole different you know item okay the basics are still the same right we still have the logo in the front we still have the shorter strap to carry it this way and then of course we have the longer straps this way okay now do I think and then of course it's the exact same thing for the pink the pink is my favorite like I love it I think this one came out recently I don't know if it came out sometime this year or sometime last year but when it came out that's when I got it and yeah you guys might as well sponsor me self I'm always getting you guys this stuff like once people drop it I'm right there and there um, but anyways this is a fave so I've had this not for that long right and I say that because I'm looking at the Uggs right I'm looking at this collaboration right here and I'm like I see a bunch of strings out I see a bunch of you know it's just a whole bunch of strings like where did the strings where are they coming from is it that was i pulling on the string myself no it just shows me that this quality might not be as good um i have had this one for a while so this might not be as great long term compared to the regular shopping bags maybe also just because of the type of material this is made out of like this material is more clothy i don't know if i'm saying that correctly you can see that this is like i don't know if this is leather or, but like this is not a cloth material right but right here it's definitely giving like cloth um especially with the fur here so i'm seeing a whole bunch of strings um so yeah do i think that this is worth that 192 um that i paid in the long run probably not right this might just be a seasonal purse that you wear once in a while just so it doesn't like get beat up like this um so maybe i should only start wearing in the winter i said it was great for winter but that doesn't mean i only wore it in the winter right um but that would be my only um complaint or you know opinion about this maybe wear it maybe make it a seasonal purse um just because i'm noticing the fact that these strings are not they're not it's not the same quality it was when i first got it like imagine this is the quality like imagine this was the quality that it was kind of when I first got it right um, you know it's still everything still looks intact it doesn't look like out of place there are no strings or anything you know out of place like you know but I only got this last year so this is telling me that by next year or uh, maybe in two years like I might be getting strings like that but that's fine I'm just gonna go ahead and make it a seasonal bag okay all right so we're through with six purses I have Four items left. We're gonna go into this Melissa collaboration. Honestly, I couldn't even tell you who Melissa is. I don't remember. All I remember was that I saw this, I think they sent it to the email. It was supposed to be a purse and some slippers or some sandals and I just wanted them because I had a trip. I had a beach trip coming up and I was like, I need this, I need this. And this was actually a gift, actually. Um, so I really, really liked how rubber looking this look like it was really giving me i'm chilling by the poolside like the transparency of it all it was really giving like beach towels like poolside beach side um you know purse bag slippers whatever um but i didn't end up getting the slippers because that thing sold out like this like i was on the, on the computer trying to check out and they said oh the the, the slippers are out of stock and i was like how fam i'm i was right here how are they out of stock like be fucking for real. But anyways, I didn't end up getting the slippers, but I still got the purse, and I'm glad I did. I was glad I did at the time, because you know, at the time, this was the only color that they had. Like, I was like, yes, I need this. Then a few months later, they released the brown, and let me tell you guys, that brown is, 
like I have it on my next you know Telfer purchase list like I have a list of things that I'm gonna get next and it's there because the brown you see how good this one looks the brown looks even better um, I don't remember let me go check how much this one was okay so I think the set with the slippers was gonna be $300 but the bag by itself was actually 200 which I don't think is bad at all it's very big I have taken this to the pool slash beach before and I was able to fit a whole bunch of things in here and it was still pretty stylish if I do say so myself it does tend to get heavy just because like this rubber material is very thick it's very, very thick um so that it gets a little heavy so don't overstuff it but with regards to functionality and like you know getting the job done how holding your things in place and all that it's very very spacious it's very like it's a nice size let me see yeah it's a nice size and like it'll fit your stuff and I like the fact that again it goes with the basic Telfair design where you have the logo in the front okay you have the short strap and then you have the longest strap okay um this one definitely worth the 200 i'm not mad at it like this is a this is a big bag like that one being 150 and how small this compared to this i think the uh, the additional 50 dollars is well is well spent okay like you're getting a lot of space out of here and you're also getting a nice cute style okay all right hey guys the next on my list is the duffel bag duffel bag this is so cute i came to have this one by accident actually this was not on my purchase list list for myself um i actually bought this for my friend at the time but i realized that it was the wrong size so i was like i'm just keeping buy you the correct size which was the bigger one but this duffel was actually 350 dollars oh we 350 dollars do i think it's worth it do i think this bag is worth 350 dollars okay let me let me get into this right this bag for a fact i've had it for at least four years like either i got in either i got in 2020 or 2021 so three to four years just like my very first um telfer bag and look at it like does it look like it's you know losing legs or you know losing material or like do, don't you think would you know if i if i didn't tell you when i bought it would you know be honest be honest with me would you know if i didn't tell you um i still have to say the bag still looks good and i've used and used and used this bag i've you traveled with this bag i've used it as a beach bag i've used it as a workout bag i've used it as a a, a carry-on bag i've used this bag i've used it very well <laughs> I don't know how else to explain that this has been a multi-purpose bag and it still does not give oh I'm old and raggedy like you know um, it's a little bit different in terms of you know the structure compared to the other Telfair like normally they'll have the logo in the front but these are on the sides actually which makes sense because these are like this sturdy part of the bag so you know on both sides you have it and those actually also happen to be pockets plenty of room in this duffel okay when i tell you i've packed with it i've packed with it and i can fit so many things in here i think i have some okay i have some tennis balls in here but there's plenty of room inside and then there's also a zipper inside 350 it is on the high side but i honestly think it's worth it considering how long i've had the bag so far and how many times i've actually used it and like how functional it is like that 350 was well spent it was well spent and you know I would do it again to be honest okay the last tougher bag that I have is my current work bag and you guys it's so cute this is the East Park collaboration I don't remember when the collaboration was but I think maybe 2022 I don't know I think after I started my current job a little bit after I started my current job so I want to say either 22 or late 21 and they said they were coming back with this bag and I said that's my new work bag that's my new work bag what are you talking about what are you talking about uh but the bag is so cute i don't like big work i don't like big bags let's let, let, let's just make that i don't know i don't like big bags so when i saw this one it just gave me the perfect tech girly work bag like work, work backpack because like it has these two straps here so i can literally wear this as a backpack but then also i can wear it as a crossbody bag because you see like you see and it fits all my essentials that i need so this fits my, my laptop it also fits like my little um notebook for work um as well as some snacks that i might have in there my aquaphor my wallet my phone my headphones um some pens like there's enough <laughs> i have some snacks in here <laughs> but like there's enough room in the bag to get everything that i need and this actually costs 180 dollars like I, yes yes it is worth it yes it's worth the price like I use this bag every day 
I've used this bag every day. Let's say, let's say I got it 2022 for the last two years. Do, does it look like, like, you know, there's some bags that, and there's some bags that I have that I can tell that, okay, you need to hang it up. It's time, baby. It's time. Like, you've been using this for a while, but like, I'm not seeing that here. I'm not seeing that here. Like, so if you ask me, $180 is well worth the price. It's well worth the price, especially for something that you can wear dual way. You can wear it as a backpack if you need to, and then you can also wear it crossbody. And of course, you have the Telfa logo there. I don't know something about the Telfa logo. I'm just like, yes, I'm wearing Telfa. And what about it? And what? The last item that I have from the Telfa collection is my little cutie wallet. <laughs> I remember when they announced this and I was like, I need a new wallet. I was just telling myself I need a new wallet. And then they announced this. Let me put it right. And then they announced this. You know, if not for the fact that I have self-control, I would have this wallet in multiple colors, but like, let me just relax. Like, it's not that serious. Um, it might be that serious, but you know. Um, but it's a wallet. I love the wallet. It's so compact, so cute. It fits in my small purses, like my tiny purses, not tiny. Most of my purses tend to be this size. So literally, the fact that it fits in my purses is like the best thing for me because that means I don't need to be holding my wallet in one hand or transferring my cards to a different card holder or something like this is so nice and it has so many compartments in here okay I hope I'm not showing you guys my cards but like I have three on this side three on this side and then I still have a middle to put stuff in like they ate with this they ate with this um that concludes all of the telfa products that i have notice i said i have i love their products so much i like gifting it to my friends because i just feel like they're such everyday go-to functional cute design like i love them anyways i said all that to say telfa you guys should sponsor me like i'm being that ass but you guys sponsor me i would really really sell i'm already doing a great job of it of, of you know selling your products to my friends and families but Imagine what I could do if we were working together. Okay. Well, anyways, that's all the products that I have for you guys today. Oh, wow. I didn't tell you guys how much the wallet was. I think the wallet was $150. Okay, the wallets are going for $144, so about $150. And I'm not going to lie, that's a bit on the high side for a wallet, especially since the shopping bags were like the same price. Um, do I think it's $144? It's worth $144. I want to say it's worth it because the quality is really good, but I can see how that might be a little bit too high. Like, I can understand if you're like, nah, that's kind of too high for a wallet, but I wouldn't mind paying it just because I know their quality of, you know, material or I know the quality of their items. That's just my personal opinion. Is it worth it? Yes, because, you know, it's 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 proven its quality to me, but um, I could see if you find something cheaper and you'd rather go with that. Okay, now that concludes everything that I have for you guys today. Please let me know if you guys have any questions. If you haven't gotten any item from Telfa and you're wondering how to get something, you probably have to sign up for like their email list so you know when they're dropping items. So if you go on their website right now, you'll probably find that a lot of things says sold out. Um, so the way that they inform us that they're dropping something is they literally send an email to us and then, or to their mailing list, I guess. And you know, you prepare for the day that they're doing the drop and like I told you when I was when I was talking about one of my bags I was literally in front of my screen when they did the drop they normally do the drop like 11 a.m. central time you know 12 p.m. eastern time and so I'm normally like in front of my computer ready to click 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 and sometimes still things still get sold out so you literally have to be on your zoom like you need to be right there and there um, for whenever they're, they're doing their drop so you can get what you need some items might stay on longer than you know the drop day but most times the items sell out this quick because everybody's literally waiting um, to get those items they also do some like throughout the year so I don't know if that's something that they're still doing where they do a Day where you can purchase as many bags as you want no limit or something I think it's no limit um, and they ship them out within three months so you don't get them right away you have to wait a little bit because you know a lot of people are ordering a lot of stuff so um, they ship them in batches but those would be the two ways um, you would purchase directly from Telfa if you decide to not purchase from Telfa you want to like purchase from like a retailer like StockX the prices will be a little bit higher but if you want to pay that extra price for convenience instead of waiting 
you're free to. Um, I have purchased from StockX before and the quality is good. They do um, screen or and check everything for you, but obviously if you get scammed, just return it and get your money back. <laughs> You'll be okay. Okay, I think I've rambled enough. Let me know what you guys think. Which of the Telford products are your favorites? Which of the collabs are your favorites if you guys have any? Um, let me know if you guys have any questions. The links will be listed below, but they'll probably say sold out. So you need to join that mailing list if you want to know when they're gonna drop some of these items. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I will see y'all in the next video. Have a lovely rest of your day. Bye.